Hi guys, in this video lecture, I am going to discuss what, how to load table records into file in Informatica. So this is the fifth lecture of Informatica Power Center. So let's go on this repository. They are selecting the folder Informatica train and this here. So this is the mapping designer. So first going to use here the source dpd. So this is so mapping design is there. So I already have the source. This is the relational table that's come from the Oracle. So let's drag this dpd into the mapping. So m under score giving here table to file. Table under score file. Let's give OK. Now here this that's or drag here the source. Then after our target should be file. So that going this here target designer. Now there after let's go on this target and click on this create. So here going to create one new target file. So giving here or uh, dpt let's give in capital letter underscore target so here you can see you can select anything file flat file informix so for a uh, flat file that's going to create so that we need to choose this and click on this create then turn then after here you can see this table has so uh, uh, three columns. One is uh, numeric, three is value. So now right clicking this, click on this add it. So three columns that going to add. One is uh, numeric. Let's give number and rest to our string. So let's give you the meaningful column name dpt number the next is let's give here d name and here location so if you want then make that primary key so let's make this dpt number primary key so i don't want any duplicate now here the file that's created if i go on this target then you can see dpt target the flat file that's created there after that here you can see dpt target flat file that's created with this now let's drag this dpt target into the mapping and here selecting the first and drag this all there Control s to save now you can see mapping is valid thereafter let's go on this workflow and they are selecting this session and that I just created here m table to file so this selecting there and now right click so before I'm going to do the right click I wanna copy the destination of the fold or directory that going to save so this saving on this let's copy this location and now let's do the changes inside the session so add it then mapping so this here that's chrome from the uh, Scott so let's skip the connection no need to change anything as there now let's go on this target so file writer that's fine and now let's give here append here header I want so here use header output field name so this I want if you don't want then you can use here no header then after the next inside the output file directory so let's uh, giving here or this location so the file that should be created on this location and here giving the file name 
so you can give any or meaningful file name let's give your dpt underscore target and creating the file csv tab so that's all fine let's click on this apply okay and there or here take this link establish there Control s to save now right click on this session so click on this start task so here you can see within few second times that's completed there and now you can see here there is a file that's created on this new tab dpt target this is a csv tab and now that's here so you can see dpt number d this all record that's whatever the record inside the source that's loaded into the dpt target and created the new file there so this is the first step is there okay this is the first step now or uh, we can achieve the same thing with the different ways also so let's see the second uh, way so creating here new mapping m underscore table underscore into file so sometimes what exactly happen so if i go on this hr let's drag there so here this is the number of uh, columns are higher so it's very tedious task to create the all columns and uh, give the data types so that here let's go on this target design now and uh, here this uh, employees that's dragging inside the target design now and here you can see so or uh, you can let's click on this rename option and giving here employees so let's give here the name this mp tct empl tct so tct in the capital letter okay and let's give okay then right click there click on this edit so here by default that selected oracle let's press f flat file that's come there so flat file and here this is the file empl tht and here you can see this all columns that's come there that's all looking fine here delimited that's all fine let's click on this apply and ok so here the file that's edited or uh, this edited successfully and converted into the file now let's go on there and the new file that's created empl tct let's drag there and uh, here the next is right click there select all selecting this all and uh, map this and control s to save so when you save here mapping is valid the next is let's go over there on this designer so here new session that's going to create there so let's take this another session so this time table into file let's select this and here right click there add it so employees this we need to give here so this that's fine that's come from the hr empl we need to do the changes so here if you want then you can select header use header command output and the file there you want to create so let's give you location there you want to create the files so this location this time there going um, i want to create the txt file so let's give you the extension txt and emp underscore tgt txt and this all looking fine no need to change there apply ok and uh, thereafter let's go on this task designer uh, stabilize the link save that and now right click there and start the task 
so oh, the task second task is running that succeeded and now you can see there so the new file empire dgt file that's created with this data the file that's created there okay so the next two is here if i go on this get session log so there you can get or uh, here the map workflow session details so you can see there so requested on this target 107 and apply affected 107 so this award here EMPA DGT so EMPA DGT and now this read 107 record from the source employees table and this loaded into the target okay and here source qualifier applied 107 and inside the target 107 that's applied there so this is how we can create here the files so this is how we can uh, load table record into the file in informatica so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you